I mean, this mom was sitting there with like a, a six month old baby that left her house because of domestic abuse. Literally just up and left, going to visit her mom and stay with her and just leave so that her kid could have a life. And this song is, is I feel like, shining light to this type of situation. Hey, what's up? A.A. Hey, Ron here for reaction number 59. We're back with the warning. And now we're into Que Mas Quieres? What more do you want? Um, and so definitely looking forward to it. This is the first time I'm reacting to the warning in Spanish. And uh, hablo español también. Entonces vamos a ver. Well, we'll see how this goes. Um, yeah, super excited. And last time you told me Make sure you react to live stuff over videos and so forth. Although, um, I like video, music videos as well because I think they do serve their own purpose. And so I'm going to listen to you and, and do that, but I'm going to mix it up at times and I'm going to do music videos as well because I think that uh, they're done for a reason, right? And they paint a different picture and they tell stories better than live performances often do. The emotions is there with the, with the live performance, the, the power and just raw feel. But sometimes the storytelling and the picture that their band originally intended to tell tells its way better through a music video. Um, so I get why people prefer live performances, but in some cases I prefer the music video. But nevertheless, I want to listen to you. So we're doing a live performance. Um, this is a recent one. So this is from uh, Pal Norte in 2024. Um, and it's 2024 as I make this. So let's get in. Que más quieres? 
Um, okay, so we're going to analyze these lyrics a little bit. Um, and so, first of all, I think that maybe I need to listen to music videos before the live version. The quality of this sound is not very good. Um, the bass is overbalanced, um, which obviously, um, you know, Ali sounds incredible. Um, you know, we don't hear as much as Danny um, on the vocals. Um, you know, it, it, it's a live performance, right? And it's not the best. Uh, what it does capture, though, is the energy in the room and the people singing along that know the chorus. Um, and the little fire bursts that are coming out was really cool. I saw a drone on the top there. You see a man walking with a bucket over his head and stuff. So um, that aspect is really fantastic. Um, the other thing I want to say, and I, I might have said it before. I don't know if I have with these girls, but just the, the completeness of their sound being a trio. How much sound they can actually produce with a trio is, is fantastic. Um, just always. And they're just always at such a high caliber, um, especially for such young girls. Um, I thought I would it would feel like it's more in their element, them singing in Spanish. But I don't know. I don't, I don't necessarily get that. It just feels like another song to me. Um, obviously very good, but just another song. Okay, let's look at the lyrics a little bit. I could not find something. I didn't, I didn't search endlessly, but I could not find something um, that showed both side-by-side -side English and Spanish. So I've just got English up. Um, and I think I have the gist of this, but I want to I look at it and just um, better understand. Um, right? And say, um, okay, I thought it was hard to hear at the very beginning. I thought she said el hambre, the hunger, but it was hard to hear um, as it started out. But the hunger that is consuming your interior, that without effort I can satiate, the thirst that you that you get only reminds me of with how little I can drown you. Holy cow, that's slack in the face, right? Um, and so without fail, what you may need, here it will be, here it is. Aquí está, I heard that. Um, tell me more. what more do you want? So that's the que mas quiere. Dime que mas quieres. Right? What more do you want? Don't deny it. In secret, I charge. I will take it all. You will never hide from me. I know that you'll always come back. Even if you want to escape, I know that you will always stay here. So powerful. I pretend to heal the same wound that I opened. I hurt you and you still return to me. In manipulating the power that you give me, I decide how it will end. Repeat, tell me what more do you want? I think that's all repeat. Yeah, all of this is repeat. So so if I get this correctly, this song's all about control and manipulation, right? Um, you know, I decide, I control you. And, you know, you come back or you're going to come back. You won't escape. Um, I know that you'll always come back, right? I know that you'll always come back even if you want to escape. I know that you'll always stay here. Um, I hurt you and you still return to me. And so it's interesting to me that they chose to write the song from the power of the controller, um, which, you know, in terms of life, it, it can be unconscious sometimes. And in that case, people may not necessarily mean to control other people or to force them to stay or otherwise. But, you know, there could be some bad things. Um, and it's interesting to tell it from that perspective because um, somebody that's manipulating other intentionally um, is just wrong, right? It's just wrong. Um, I was at the airport a couple days ago and... I let this woman in front of me and I mean, this mom was sitting there with like a, a six month old baby that left her house because of domestic abuse, literally just up and left going to visit her mom and stay with her and just leave so that her kid could have a life. And this song is, is, I feel like, shining light to this type of situation. Is that 
some people do have such control over others that they can manipulate them. Um, wow. And it's just this, this constant cycle of hurt and return and pain. Um, and that it, it's like the inevitability. I know that no matter what you're going to return, you're going to come back. I've already manipulated you. Um, well, this is powerful. And the fact that they're singing a chorus together, right? When they, when they say, you know, tell me what more do you want? Que mas quieres? Right? Um, it, like, so, I'm, so it's almost like a balance though. I'm controlling you, but I'm also providing for you. I'm giving you everything you need. Um, so what more do you want? You know, I'm controlling you. I, you, you keep coming back. What do you, like, I'm treating you like garbage and you still want more? Like, what, what is wrong with you? Why do you keep coming back? It's like a brainwashed, um, gosh, once again, these, these lyrics hit home. Um, I feel like to me, the lyrics are way more potent than the song itself. I like the song. It's got a nice groove. I like the chorus. I, th I don't think this live version, and sure, I might have chosen the wrong one, but I wanted to choose something recently, and I actually wanted to choose something randomly. Um, but um, I feel like the song itself, especially the lyrics, definitely hit home more than the arrangement and their performance of it. Um, I like the song. I like the groove. Um, these lyrics are powerful, though. Um, it's a crazy message, and... You know, I hope that, I mean, every, obviously everybody can interpret it how they want, and I might be interpreting it differently than was intended. But to me, this is actually a, a motivating song, is that you might be in a situation where you feel that you can't control it and you're always going to come back and that there's no way out. Um, but hopefully you can use this as a refuge that, you know, you can find help, you can, you can seek it and make change and going back to kind of the intent of the band, the warning, right? You've been warned. Um, more importantly, perhaps is if you see the signs coming, if you are in a situation, I'm not just talking about a relationship. Um, it could be as, as crazy as governmental control, right? The system has control and has manipulated you. Yet you keep coming back for support. What more do you want? We're going to continue to treat you like this. Um, it can be true on so many different levels. Um, so there are metaphors flying left and right here. But once again, this band is just incredible. Um, thank you for recommending it to me and, and you know, continuing to push for me to do more. Um, I very much enjoyed this and I will do more. So if you haven't yet subscribed, please go do so now. And we will see you in the next one.